Hey planner friends, welcome back to my channel. Today's plan with me is going to be, again, in my Erin Condren uh, neutral vertical. Um, and I'm going to be planning for the week of August 7th through the 13th. Um, and this is my mom's birthday. So I wanted to use this really, really pretty um, kit from Rack Paper Stickers. Um, it's just this really, I like the really, um, can I say really a couple more times? Um, I really like the uh, different colors of the navy with the like the peach coral and the like mint kind of teal color with a little bit of pops of yellow. Um, I think that's super pretty. Here's the deco sheet. You've got your icons, um, some different boxes, some bildus, weekend banners, um, icons as well. I really like those meal icons. I'm definitely going to be using all of those. And then you've got your um, check flags, um, different little icons down here, some half boxes, all of the washi, and then your headers, some hydrate stickers, and then some event labels. So um, there's no full boxes in, in this, um, like the ombre heart checklist full boxes, which is actually okay. I was probably, um, I was really planning on using like these, I think the little ones um, this time anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started by putting down the bottom washi. And I don't know if you can see on camera, but I did some stamping last week. Um, so you can see kind of some shadowing. So I'll probably end up putting like the full boxes in places where like that'll cover it up. Um, so then you can't see that. But I'm gonna go ahead and start with just the bottom washi just to give me um, like a base to kind of start things on. So I think both of these are the same size. Yeah, so I'm just gonna put this start all the way over here. And I'm gonna go ahead and just put it right in the top. I might end up going f and find another Oops, I'm going to move that over just a little bit. Um, another little bit of washi just to put underneath it to kind of cover up some of this down here. Which maybe, okay, so now that I'm thinking about it, I think I'm going to put this all the way at the bottom. So I'm going to start it over here. And then I can use like the meal icons there. And that way that'll sh cover up that shadowing that's happening above there. Oh, well, I'm gonna put it down anyway. Okay, so there was that little bit that you saw, I should have switched those, but this doesn't want to come up very well and I'd already put that down so that looks fine. Okay, so now, like I said, I'm going to use the hydrate stickers. That's what I'm going to use. I'll use the hydrate stickers across here. And I'm just going to kind of start, I think I put them in um, the order that they currently are in. So I'll put like the dark blue. And I'm just going to put it right on there. And I'm going to put those all the way across and then I will come. Okay, so I've got all of those down. So now I'm going to do the same thing with the meal icons. Um, and I think I, I bought I bought this kit a while ago from um, Rack Paper Stickers. And I think when I bought the kit, like you, and it might still be the same way. I haven't been on her site for a little while. But you could pick um, specifically which sheets you wanted. So I picked the sheets that I thought I would use most most of so I'm not I I think that's why that I, I mean if you're looking for like the full boxes and stuff like I think that's or the full box checklist that's why I don't have those okay perfect so I've got the meals down the hydrate stickers down we are good to go I am going to now go in and I think put down like I need the checklists I've got the headers a little bit of washi and then I've got the full boxes. I think I'm going to start with the full boxes and just kind of put them over here where they cover up some of these spots where I put really like you can see um, the shadowing on the stickers. So and just kind of like haphazardly put them around. Let's put this one first up in the top and then I can write a little thankful thought or something up in there. OK, 
Okay, and then let's just start and kind of maybe use them in somewhat of an order of color wise. So the biggest is here. So let's just put this down here. That covers up that little bit. And then I think this one is really pretty. And then I've got a lot up here, but I've got some right here. So I think I'll just stick it over here where that is. And let's just do at the very top right there. And then this is pink and yellow. Okay, so I've got those down. So now I'm going to put down the um, checklists. And I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm just gonna do the today headers um, around the checklists. And then that way it's not like a to-do list, it's not like a to-do list, it's just like whatever I wanna keep track of that day. So I'm gonna use the little ones. Do I wanna to do today? Or I could use to do and put the today in the other spot. Cause I don't really wanna use little things. Okay, so let's use, let's do that. I'll do a to do and then a today section. So I'm gonna put the to do here cause it's short with the checklist. And then I wanna put the today up here. And then let's see, Tuesday, let's start with, yeah, let's do the to-do up here. And then under the full box, let's do the today sticker. Perfect. Um, I actually already know two big things that I want to keep track of on one on Tuesday. We are watching um, Miranda Lambert is going to be at Red Rocks. So I want to denote that. And then Monday I have an appointment for my Invisalign. Unfortunately. So I do have like little um, teeth icons, so I'm just gonna wait and grab those and put that up there for just a second. So let's go ahead and move on to Wednesday is pink. So that, let's do Wednesday. I don't think I have anything kind of crazy happening. So let's do a today that covers up this section. This like little spacing and then do a to do with a little box right here. I think this is really pretty how this is coming out. It's definitely a little different from how I've been planning, but I like, I'm definitely trying to find my groove in this one where there's not, there's no headers. So I'm trying to like leave more space. Um, so we'll see if that's actually working out. Now Thursday, there is the last concert series after work um, at Stella's uh, on the plaza, the music on the plaza. So I want to use that to denote that. So let's give myself um, a today header. And this one, let's see. Because I've got a longer box here, I may cut this so then they all are the three. So let me cut this down so it matches. Okay, here we go. So let's do a to-do at the top. And then this. And then a today. And that way if I have like a half box, I will, that'll cover that up and let's make sure that this is straight though. Because that is not straight at all.
But I like this kit because I like the fact that it's um it's going to be a lot more white space, and I'm really enjoying that. Um, I did like a Harry Potter like stamping and stuff last week. I'm still getting finished with it, but I like all the white space in here. So I kind of wanted to try to mimic that, but still use a kit. Um, I did, I was missing, I definitely was missing a kit with trying to just use stamps last week. It definitely was out of my comfort zone. Um, but that's always, you know, that's good too, so. Okay, so let's do one more to do right here. And then checklist. And then I'll give myself the today header down here. And then Saturday, I want to put the weekend banner at the top before I go any further. And I think I'm going to use this one with the yellow. And again, it always seems like I'm getting my nails done when I'm right before I'm filming. So like I did today. I ripped my little bow off, but that's okay. It fits right there. Okay, so the weekend banner is now down. Um, Sunday morning is, like I said, uh, Sunday is my mom's birthday. So I could use like a little birthday icon. What's well, both my mom and my um, nephew. So is that gonna give me enough space to write that in? Maybe I'll put it right there and then I can just write their birthdays. Okay, so let's go back and finish my to-dos and my todays. So I need a to-do and a today. If I put this here, that gives me enough space for the to-do header. And then I can do today. And then pink. So I think I'm gonna have to do today. And then I could use like a half box to cover that up and then give myself a checklist down here. And mainly this to do is probably going to be like planning and videos and editing and all that stuff. Okay, perfect. I'm really, really liking this. Okay, so let's go back and work on planning now like the extra little stuff. So like I said, I've got stickers for um, Monday for my uh, dentist appointment. Okay, so here are my little teeth icons, these itty bitty girl teeth from Sweet Quiet Designs. So I got those to mark all of my orthodontist appointments. So that is going to be a big one on Monday. So I'm gonna use this really pretty box. I have to be there right at like 9.50 to check in. They're gonna give me my first round for my two weeks trial um, to start and then I have to go back in and get some adjustments made to how those are working. Um, so I've got that down. I also want to keep track of my workouts this week. I'm going to try to do two strength and two cardio. So I've got these stickers from Rack Paper Stickers. So I'm just going to grab one cardio and then one strength that I've already used some from. Um, and let's see, strength is going to be on Monday. So let's go ahead and put this kind of darker blue sticker down. And these are just gonna be where I can find space to put them. So like I said, Tuesday is the concert, so there won't be a workout. Wednesday will be a workout, so let's do cardio. Let's put this at the bottom of the today section. And I don't think I've got anything else kind of going on for Wednesday, so Let's see, Thursday will then be um, nothing because I'm gonna be um, after work, like I said, going to this concert. So then Friday, let's do a strength. So I need, I need another blue strength one. And then let's just put this one here. And then I need a cardio, like a teal one. And let's put that on Saturday. Okay, so I've got those down. Thursday is also 
um, I believe the first preseason game for the Green Bay Packers. So I've got this additional sticker sheet from Rock Paper Stickers. Seems like that's kind of all I'm gonna be using this week, which works out. So I'm gonna use this sticker for Thursday, the 10th, and I'm just gonna put that right here. I know it doesn't really match all that much, but I mean, I have to use the stickers. Like I am a huge Green Bay Packers fan, so it's happening. Okay, so I'm gonna zoom out. The other thing that I have on Monday is the, our grass gets mowed on Monday. So I'm gonna put this little mow the grass sticker, again from Rock Paper Stickers, and I'm gonna stick that right here. That works. Okay, so let's see if I've got the majority of the plans that I know are there happening. So I've got the birthdays, and I may actually put like a box for the birthdays on like the today section here. I don't know if I like this. Let's try something else. So let's use the little birthday icon that I missed or that I took off from here. And let's just put that right here. And then I can write whose birthday it is. And then on Sunday, let's put these. And I can write the birthdays for mom and Dakin in this manner. Well, I'll keep them like this. Okay, so I went and found some little stickers from my stash. So I'm gonna use these Boulder Bond birthday stickers for um, the birthday. So I'm gonna use these little candles. These are super cute. And then maybe in a little cake right here. Perfect. And then I'll use another little candle up here. And I'm gonna remove this. Actually, I like that that's kind of up there. I may move these. There we go, okay. So now that, that'll just kind of denote that there's a birthday there and then there's two on the 13th. And then I've got the little cake here. So then let's just do some balloons. Right here and right here. There we go, okay. There we go, so now that's enough of birthday stuff over here. Okay, so I've got my workouts, preseason. I've got the stellar concert, stellar concert. Um, I'm going to, I pulled out these little wine girl stickers. I thought they kind of matched really pretty with that coloring scheme. So I'm gonna use her for Thursday. And then I found these from Once More With Love that I had bought. And I wanna use this Let's Go To A Concert on Tuesday. So I'm just gonna put this here and then Miranda Lambert or Red Rocks. These are so cute, I need to use more of those. Okay, so I think that's the majority of everything I wanna put down. Um, I do have a couple of these other stickers. I've got a couple bill dues, um, but I think I'm, I'm not gonna use, I think, too many of these, because I don't think they really fit at this point, and I kinda wanna keep it clean. Since I'm using, like I've got my bills here, I don't necessarily need them in this week other than just to look back and make sure that I've got them paid. So I'm cool with that. I don't really think I'm gonna put down anything else. I don't really have anything for Friday other than we'll probably do like a date night so I can grab one of these stickers or whatnot. So I think I'm going to go ahead and maybe decorate with a little bit of this and then put down a little bit of, let's do the sidebar. So let's see, I didn't use any of these I'm wondering if maybe I could use some of these like down the sidebar um, that I could use like just a general to do, to go, to clean, um, to buy. Yeah, let's use that. And then let's see, Friday is trash day. So let's look at some of these icons really quickly as well while we're here. Um, I generally do like a weigh in on Monday. So let's put that with like the little strength right there. Um, grocery shopping, I'm definitely gonna need to go to the grocery store. Let's put that on the to-do section 
for Saturday. Has to happen. So I think we're good. So let's put a little bit of, I think I'm gonna use this washi down the side and like mix and match some of these, these little stickers like I mentioned here. So let's zoom in really quickly and I will just kind of start using some of this down. do and like I said these will just be like weeklies weekly things that I want to try to get done or I won't even have to use them so so let's zoom out so I just used the washi as it went down and then added all the little boxes and it just gave a nice like sidebar there um, to start with okay so now I think I'm just gonna add a little bit of decoration and then I am done so I've got all of this decoration here so I definitely want to use some of it so I think I'm gonna use this one on Friday since I've got the biggest space for like a today. And I think maybe I'll just cut off the top. Perfect, and then if we do like a date night or something, like that'll be a little fun sticker there. And then these bows are adorable. I definitely wanna make sure I use a couple of these. Done. I'm gonna stop putting stickers down. Okay, so I still have a ton of stickers even though I kind of, like I said, I think when I bought these, I was able to pick which sheets I knew I would probably use stickers from. Um, so I've got the rest of these, I've got the rest of the deco, this bit of washi, some icons, bildus. I didn't use any of these, so I can look into the, see if I can use those. And then I used a majority of these, but I've got a couple little event stickers and little things there. So, so I think that's where I'm gonna leave it. I am really excited about this. I like the idea of having more white space um, and having the full boxes kind of just wherever. It's just kind of fun and whimsical, I think, this week. Um, and this kit is just really pretty for like transitioning into um, fall from the summer. So I really hope you guys like this. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.